Hi guys, how you doing? My name is Crystal. If you like my videos, please smash that like button. Please do subscribe. Just taking a walk around the field this evening with Max. It's one minute past eight. And before I left my flat, my mum called the phone again. So let's listen to it. My mum's message before I left the flat. So she calls me before she goes to bed, obviously. <laughs> Usually get three calls, sometimes four or five. So I'm outside, I got a call just before I left the building. I've got to take Max out for a walk. Dogs need to go to the toilet and they need exercise. And um, the sun's going down. And it's, it's not dark, but it's uh, getting dark. It's gradually the light's fading. So I just thought I'd take Max out for a walk. I think I'm drinking too much coffee because I feel like wound up, if you know what I mean. I'm going to have to cut the coffee out. I drink too much of it. I know I do. <laughs> so, the field this evening. Still some light, I still I can see. It's going to get dark soon. <laughs> but, being stuck in that flat most of the day the majority of the day you get I don't know what you call it fed up I honestly feel like I'm in prison and I get phone calls from my mother I do sometimes it's just odd and I've never known anybody else's mum speak to them like my mother speaks to me. <laughs> How she speaks, if you know what I mean. I just get fed up. I'll start the day thinking, right, I'm gonna, we'll get through this, we'll get through this day, we'll occupy our mind, we'll find things to do. And it always goes pear-shaped in the evening. Usually getting around five, six o'clock, I start to get doom and feel like doom and gloom. <laughs> I feel like a baby. And she, she phoned again. I'm gonna let him off the lead for a bit. Let's see. Go on. I've had a good day. I didn't go anywhere near those drunks. Come on. Come on, Max. Put my vitamin drink up. 
vitamin three, vitamin B12, get more vitamins, tiredness and fatigue. <sighs> Trains coming into Rochester Station. I just saw some of my fucking stuff from 2016 when I was living in Chatham. Facebook brings up your old stuff. My God, I had a shock. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's wonderful. That guy train going past the castle, Rochester Castle, look. All lit up. Bullet train. Wow. Look at that. You've got the sunset over there. It's not very, very red, but... Now where's he gone? Where's Max gone? He's been slow all day, now he's running off. Let's look at the castle lighting up. That. That's why I love this place. You're right near the castle and the cathedral. I've got to go. I've got to go and visit that castle at some point. I've been. I've been inside Up North Castle. Up North Castle. I've been inside there. Up North. It's a nice castle. That. I've been to to Wales. I've been inside the Welsh castle that's uh, got 24 karat gold uh, gold walls I think in it some of it because <sighs> Gloucestershire is uh, not too much of a train journey to Wales from Gloucester where I used to live many many years ago <sighs> Gotta watch him because it's starting to get dark and I don't want him to run off. <laughs> but he's starting to put a pace on Max, that's it. <laughs> I know he's had two short walks today and I wanted him to get some exercise because he hasn't been going to the toilet properly. <laughs> So if he has a bit of a exercise, it'll help, won't it? Well, I hope everybody's had a lovely weekend so far. I mean, I have done a lot today. It's just... It's a bit samey. issues if I go too far away from somewhere by myself and I get unwell then I've got to make my own way back and I haven't got a car or anything so I've got to be careful you see I can't go too far anyway <laughs> It's a light up, so that's pretty. So we're halfway around the field now, it's not pitch black yet.
Right, I'm going to leave it here. I'll leave you with the view of the castle and the Rochester Cathedral. And I'll see you later.